Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to a very sunny day in Shangu. My name is Yuki with Bali Texture, where we specialize in architecture, construction, and sales. And this tropical paradise perfection right behind me here will blow your mind. And I'll show you why. Now, with that said, let's go and have a look. Welcome into Casa Donilo, guys. We are in the heart of Changu at the moment and make sure you guys are buckled up with your popcorn ready because we have a lot to cover, right? Right as I uh, entered, I noticed a facade which is uh, quite unique. You know, it's that slanted roof facade with beautiful finishings on the windows and also the incorporation of the wood that they use along with the facade makes it seem very, very welcoming and inviting as well. Now, not only is the facade beautiful, but you have lots of garden space right here which you don't really see often in any of us so it's um quite spacious to say the least and now that we have that area covered let's uh, check out the main areas here now right as you enter you have a seating area over here suitable for about four people or so and then moving uh, across from it, you have a dining table area. Solid wood right here, you know, you could fit eight person, uh, host a huge dinner, no problem. Right behind it, you have the kitchen area, right? A beautiful kitchen island as well with uh, four bar stools, pendant lights, and pretty much every appliance that you need uh, to cook a great meal. So overall, spacious, lovely, and what more could I say? And now we are gonna go into one of my favorite parts in any villa that I tour, and that is the infamous sunken sofa. So sunken sofas are very, very popular because they give that uh, illusion of the living room being much more spacious than it actually is because of course it's sunken, right? Uh, and we see this in every villa, one of maybe every villa that we tour uh, here in Changu, Uluwatu and other areas of Bali in this space particularly feels very, very unique and nice, uh, different from the ones that I have seen in uh, other tours, mainly because we have a large pocket garden here and also blinds that come up and down. So every time you want a little bit of privacy, you can by, you know, bringing these blinds down and uh, pulling them up when you feel like it. So it's overall a great space. You have tons of greenery overlooking this beautiful sunken sofa and not to mention as well the 52 inch tv i believe it's a 52 inch tv just uh complements this space very very well you also have terracotta pots on the wall here uh that is set to decorate this space and overall it's a beautiful place and i feel very very astonished All right, guys, now that we have the beauty of the living room covered, we're gonna go ahead and tour the bedroom area, guys. Now, this villa consists of four bedrooms in total, uh, one twin and both of them, and three of them king size, actually. So we're gonna tour the uh, first one over here. Right as we enter the bedroom area, you know, you're greeted with so much space over here, right, guys? We have a seating area here suitable to get your work done uh, and everything, and also a king size bed right in front of it. Well, I mean, I'm just stunned. You know, you have immediate access to the Villa's infinity pool and also access to all this greenery right here and this beautiful facade, right? But we haven't finished checking out the bedroom yet because it has an ensuite bathroom, which we'll go ahead and check out right now. So come follow me. Welcome into the bedroom's ensuite bathroom. Right in front of where we have a white terrazzo sink and also a mirror uh, with wood on the edges here. You know, all the basics. Uh, you have terrazzo right here as well and a shower. Uh, pretty much everything you ever need. Quite spacious for a bathroom, I would say. Now with that said, let's go and check out the bedroom right next door.
Welcome in guys into the second bedroom. This is actually a twin bedroom as you can see here. Uh, you know, right over there you have the night lights and also a window showcasing some greenery. I love how they do that. And another thing I love as well is these wooden beams that they have placed on the ceiling here. They've done that on the bedroom, the first bedroom we toured and it's amazing. These arches here are also notable as well. You know, you have a wardrobe, a mirror, and also an ensuite bathroom, which is much wider than the one we've seen before. As we enter here, we have a large mirror, a river stone sink, and also a shower over here with gallum wood on top and uh, also lots of natural white stone, which is, I think, incredible. So let's check out the bedrooms on the second floor. All right, now guys, we are gonna go ahead and check out the second floor area. And I wanna show you guys this unique stairs right here that has a curve effect and also wooden finishings on the steps right here. One noticeable thing as well about this area as I'm going up is that the roof, uh, as I've mentioned before, the slanted roof here, gives the illusion that this portion of the house seems more spacious and higher uh, because it technically is, right? Uh, which I find really, really cool and uh the finishings on the roof over there also is extremely unique and beautiful to say the least also these pendant lights and everything that this villa has to offer is just astonishing now two bedrooms situated to my right and my left we're going to see them both one has a balcony which i want to show you guys as well so come on over Welcome to the third bedroom situated on the second floor. It's not as big as the first two we've seen, but a beautiful masterpiece nonetheless, right? You have everything you ever need, all the essentials. It ticks all the boxes and it also has an ensuite bathroom. This bathroom consists of a terrazzo sink, a circular mirror, a toilet, and also a shower over to my left-hand side. Now with that said, let's go and check out the master bedroom. All right, guys, so now we are going to go ahead and tour the last bedroom, the master bedroom, and it's situated right on the edge of the second floor platform, which is really, really nice, guys. So come on in, let me show you around. All right, guys, now one unique feature about this bedroom is that it has a balcony overlooking the uh, whole property and also tons of greenery as well and in an amazing weather like this it's a perfect time to go ahead sit outside read a book and have a cup of coffee as well now going back into the bedroom you know you have a king size bed with two night lights and uh, two uh, bedside stands as well along with a large tv to the right of it and also a cabinet area a few terracotta pots uh, for decoration and you can see here the built-in cabinets and also a window on both sides and finally the ensuite bathroom come on in this master bathroom is fully coated in white which is amazing and different to the bathrooms that we've seen before as you can see here they love to emphasize on the terrazzo uh, as you could tell from the sink and also the bathtub which is made out of terrazzo uh, high quality appliances nonetheless and i love how this light shines down on the white stone which is uh pretty cool and uh with that said let's go and check out the best part about this bedroom which is the balcony Come outside to the balcony with me guys uh this space right here is a space that i absolutely love because you know you could coat under bali's beautiful weather especially today with the clear blue skies and we're also not in uh the central part of Chiang. we're kind of on the outskirts a little bit uh which is fairly quiet and it's a great space to relax once again i'm overlooking this amazing infinity pool which we will go ahead and check in just a moment
It's been tempting me for a while now. I've been wanting to jump in the pool ever since I stepped onto this property. So let me get this away. All right, that concludes the end of the villa tour. Thank you guys so, so much for watching all the way through. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and comment your favorite features about this villa. My name is Yuki with Bali Texture, and I'll see you in the next one.